Tableau do it yourself tutorial level of detail LOD calculations in this video we will see how to calculate or work with level of detail calculations So you must download this file. If not, send an email. We'll be very happy to send it to you. Create a new sheet with 27 and drag and drop country field on the columns shelf. And then drag and drop the claim amount fields field on the rows shelf. Let's do that. So rename this as DIY27 and drag country the column shelf and claim amount to the row shelf. Select the type of measure aggregation property as average. And what do you think? Does it look right? Let's do that. Sum of claim, go to measure and select average so average of claim amount for India is 150 UK is 150 while US is 100 let's look at our data set so for average claim amount there is only one claim for India so ideally the amount which is going to be 300 should be the claim amount average for India. For UK, there are two claims and each of this has 300. So the average claim amount for UK should be two claims for $600. That will be $300 and same for US US has two claims or three uh, two claims and each of this claim has 300 and 200 each which is $500 one two three four five hundred and two claims so the average claim amount should be 250 so for India we are looking at 300 for UK we are looking at 300 while US we are looking at 250, 250. But what it is giving me here, it's giving me 150, 150 and 100 dollars. The reason is it's going at the line level, claim item level, but not at the claim ID level. So let's do a calculation and this type of this type of calculation would be known as level of detail this calculation for level of detail means that I want to do this claim amount calculation at not the item level but at the claim ID level and we will write a level of detail calculation so to create this calculation this is the syntax include that means include at claim ID level sum of claim amount there are three types of keywords you can use for LOD calculation and I would encourage you to work some examples based on the same data set which has been provided the first keyword is include second is fixed that means it takes care of anything which is or any dimension which is in the calculation irrespective of the dimension what's in the view I repeat include is taking care of claim ID in accordance with the dimensions you have in the view fixed if you use fixed calculation keyword fixed claim ID 
it's going to take care of the dimension in the calculation but not in the visualization and if you use exclude which is your third keyword this is going to exclude the dimension in the visualization and still going to calculate this so for now we are doing include include claim id sum of claim amount so at a claim id level do a sum of claim amount let's do this calculation so create a new calculation and i'm going to call it as lod claim amount and i'm going to write include claim id sum of claim amount you can see the calculation is valid here click on apply click on ok and drag and drop this here and instead of sum turn it to average now let's see for India you can see it's now 300 which is correct as compared to 150 earlier for UK it's 300 as compared to 150 earlier and US is 250 which we expected as compared to 100 earlier I'm gonna do some coloring based on this so you can see that this is what we wanted let me change the color so this is for India UK and US this is what we wanted for average claim amount at a claim ID level and this is the claim amount at claim item level in your projects probably this is what they are looking at now let's see how to create a calculation with the keyword fixed so I'm going to use keyword fixed so create a calculation new calculation and say hello D fixed so instead of include I'm gonna use fixed and again I'm gonna add this over here and change it to average now in order for clarity of understanding I'm gonna use text please see the change you can expand this box here to understand what kind of or what calculations are here so this is fixed LOD for India why is it showing 600 for UK why it's showing 450 and for US why is it showing 250 interesting isn't it so let's look at the calculation again and fixed claim ID sum of claim amount include was just fine so let's understand the fixed so so this is I'm just trying to set up the screen all right so look at that for India there is only one claim now remember I told you that for fixed irrespective of what is there here in the visualization it does the calculation so for C1 irrespective of the country let's see what's the amount so irrespective of the country the amount is 600 you can see the sum at the bottom 600 and because India has only one claim it says 600 let's talk about UK in UK you have C1 which gives you 600 irrespective of country and C4 which is 900 but remember UK the number of claims are 2 and the total number of values 
of the claims attached to UK irrespective of country that means these two rows and these four rows are 900 divided by 2 which is 450 and then US is pretty straightforward the fixed and the include for US, USA does not change the reason is none of the claims are across countries for US within that set the number of claim or the claims are unique all right and we are going to talk about now exclude calculation so copy this function and let's see what exclude does remember exclude as discussed it's going to exclude all the dimensions which are not part of the expression that means even the dimensions which are present in the visualization so LOD exclude and this is your exclude I'm gonna add it and see here India shows and I'm gonna bring this again here so India is 300 so it does not do the average oh I need to change it to average so measure average now it does not do anything else rather than just putting the number for that claim so for this claim the number is 300 it just puts it out there irrespective of country it does not care even for UK it says 600 so for UK it's all 600 irrespective of any measure other than the one on the on the calculation boom and UK so probably you won't use exclude much of um, often you're gonna include use include and fixed so time for some hands-on exercises all right let's do the following hands-on exercises create a new tableau sheet and do the same thing instead of claim amount bring in paid amount and do the LOD calculations for include fixed and exclude thank you for watching